And we're back in the game with some more Call of Warhammer Beginning of the End Times version 2 playing as Bretonia. Alright, we've got uh, Aquitaine under siege and I think they have to sally out because judging by the unit cards there's not many of them left. So let's go and face them and try to shoot them as they come out of the settlement. We should be able to win this one fairly easily. And that looks like some kind of shaman. Orc shaman. Riding around on an arachnok. An arachnorok, I should say. Okay. Get close enough to shoot them. A lot of cavalry in this force, don't we? One, two, three, four. Infantry. Much infantry. Basically, there to slow the enemy down. Won't you stop? Because apparently you're getting shot as well. They're charging out with their bowmen. Zoomed in too far. Not shooting. Shoot. Shoot them. Shoot them. Alright, some cavalry, make use of those. Come up on this flank. We'll have to come up there. Some heavy cav. Or oh, it's the lightest heavy cav that we have. When you come out of skirmish mode, just stand there and start shooting. Alright, like thinking about charging out. Right. Get in amongst the peasant bowmen. Guess we should bring our general up. To give the units a morale boost. Come on over here. How well are we doing against their general? Out of 15. Some light cavalry over there as well. I think we've taken out most of those archers. Yep, they've got units starting to rout already. Charging over there. We're into the settlement. Archers, stop your engines. Go and run all of those down. Uh, enemy generals down to two, whatever his name was. Nobody's going to remember him. That's what happens when you're on the losing side. Right. Why don't you just go and run all the way. And he's down. End the battle. We lost 128. And we've got a good, decent sized settlement. Aquitaine is a city, I think, or the castle. Death by my hand was always their fate. Oops, worth 806. I think we'll probably just occupy it. Right, anything in there that we need to destroy? But we can send some units back into these settlements, can't we? Got three units, one of which needs to be retrained. So we'll send you up to there. Uh, you can make it all the way up to there. 
send you all the way up to there. Send you into there. Good. And some of you need retraining. There, forty, and that one. Come down here for some retraining. Else needs retraining. Right, you do that next turn. So up there. You up there? Ah, the Wood Elves have captured the Black Chasm. Interesting. 13,000. Is that it during an end turn? Yeah, I think it was. So, did we miss some messages? Now, we're not building anything at Koran. Change that. Same as Anguil, Claret, got those extra units, yeah, priest in there, not going to benefit us, that might, We're almost out of money, need to send those down, let's find out what's in here. All right, so there's a good amount of troops in there. Those are going to be pretty powerful. Those will all be pretty weak. And we need to build something over here. All right, quite a bit of corruption. 225. Get rid of it from building that, maybe. Nope, that's only going to reduce it by about 30. It's not really worth it, is it? Port. Can I add any income? That will. Yeah. It's the best return. Now we've got some diplomats somewhere. Okay, diplomats, they're wandering around. Trying to talk to people. You're up in Chaos Land, aren't you? Yep. And you're keeping an eye. I think we're going to send you to talk to the dwarves. What I think we are going to do. Get all the way up here. Go and talk to the Nurgles. Try and get some money. Just rejected. They're well off. See that. Alright, so our next target is going to be Musalon. Right. Still haven't been attacked by vampires, which is good. I don't want to be attacked by them. Ah, uh, we can see from the border that this settlement is now Wood Elf territory. Whatever that's called. And the others. Um, so, need to build up a force. We've got, we've got two free generals. One of them can take command up here. I think this force will actually come out and attack us. They'll probably feel brave enough. But we're expecting a good amount of money next turn now. Yeah, trade is going up there. Farming isn't worth anything, neither is mining. We have merchant trade. I'm not even sure if we have a merchant. Hopefully the vampire counts will stay busy with the Empire, the Wood Elves and the Dwarves. All 
Right. Yeah. Blockaded again. Ah, yes. We saw these last time. The Vampire Coast. But they only had three units last time. So I'm kind of thinking that they have a territory down here. It's that one. There's one up here. There's one here. There's one there. And then there used to be one over here. But they must have got over from that place. The South America version. Lustria? Yeah. That's what it was. Right, start building up those forces. Okay, extra unit there. Um, send those up. We got one archer. Gonna need some extra archers. Let's talk to. Ah, we found Horn as well. You may speak, but I should not expect us to agree. We can get some money out of them. Yep. Good. Now, the map has been changed. You used to be able to get through here, and all the way past here, and even through here. Now it's all been blocked off. You can't get to this area, and you can't get to this area. I should go by C. So, talk to the Chaos Wars. We're going to have to come on over here. Now, let's see if we can get up to those dwarves. You got kicked out. So, go on back in. Might get another. One of those spy to build, if anything. I don't think you need anything there. Waterloo. Get that. Got a water mill. Not that happy, though, are you? Pigeon. The Problem. We've got the Lady of the Lake Shrine. Have to put the priest in there. Cool. We can get three archers. Right. Can't get a priest there though. Can't get a priest up here. Why? That was already built there then. Alrighty. But doesn't think we'll get any extra trade. Build a port for some reason. To build that. Right. Now, down here. Something for the border, maybe? Or not? Not. So you're recruiting three archers. You're retraining those. Actually, do it like that. Um, more spearmen. They're dirt cheap. Let's get a priest in there. You need a priest. Get all those archers that I can. Two archers and a priest. Got a little money left over. Right. And we should have a force big enough to go after Musalon. We need to organize it though.
and a new family member sponsored by the Green Knight. Yes, we shall accept him wherever he went. Paying attention. Right. Who are we going to send? You have not great morale, um, loyalty, but a better general. Right, we'll send you. Right. Let us stop waiting and take the walls, we? Ah, can't reach. Shame. All good. More lock. All good. More lock. We get. Can't even reach there. We'll take all four of those. All good. We know the army. More lock. Send all of those. Ah, that's where he showed up because he was sponsored by the Green Knight. We send out from there that unit, that unit. Well, they can reach there. Send them up. So he's got four, eight units. Right. Aha, vampires. Are they going to come after me? It's a good question. Will the vampires come after me? Well, we could have a battle against the vampires fairly soon. That gives us a chance to showcase them, or at least some of their units. Right, how about paying us instead of shearing? Well, good. It's a large area, we don't have any map info out here. Look to Kislev, maybe should be a Kislev settlement down there. Got two, three priests and a spy. Oh, there's, he's an unscrupulous looking fellow, isn't he? We de Artois. Okay, I'm fairly certain they're going to attack us. I'm not going to recruit any other troops. I'm just going to see what they do. We are going to keep working on our economy. It's forty two hundred. Can't really boost the taxes up anywhere. Want to build anything? I can get a printing press. So no extra troops there, troops there, there. Uh, we still have some work to do. We'll have to send all of them. Now let's see what these will do. Ah. 
Aha, they attacked Aquitaine. Alright, so we're going to have to divert forces to deal with those. And they might even have artillery. Let's see. I think they do. They must have artillery. Last. Yep. Ooh, zombie mortar. Look at that. And animated hulks. Okay, well, if you're actually watching this, then you're in for a fun treat because you're going to get to see the zombie deck gunners, the necroflex, animated hulks, zombie hand gunners, which should have a capital H, and zombie mortar. Look at that. Hmm. Well, all we have is swordsmen. You might be able to take out their artillery. Animated hulks. They've got four hit points. And a lot of defense. Wow. Um, necroflex. I'm not even sure what a necroflex is. I guess I could read the description. Necroflex colossus are giant, reanimated hulks of flesh and rotting wood. Shipwrecks provide the necessary ingredients for such an abomination. For a great amount of corpses, timber and rigging are required for construction to begin. But no mere backwards necromancer has power has power to raise such a beast. It requires a greater understanding of the dark arts only few possess. Once raised, the necroflex is no mindless thrall. Instead, a creature with its own uh, deftly wills and dark desires. Interesting. I have to take a close look at that on the battlefield. Alright, well, we're going to have to defend. Unfortunately, Alfred, you're probably going to die. So, that's a bit unfortunate that we're going to lose that settlement, almost certainly. But, uh, they do have artillery. We're going to have to get our general out there as quickly as possible. Go up on those walls. And leave you there. Ah, before we even start, can we zoom in? Yes, we can. So, what's this? Is that the Necrofex? That's a pretty cool <laughs> animation, isn't it? Yeah, you can see that's the front of the ship. Leave that the prow. And it's kind of an arm, like a um, tree spirit would have. And it's carrying a cannon in that one, just to claw that one. Ah, that's pretty neat. That's the crow's nest, isn't it? There is somebody in there, isn't it? Yeah, so it actually has a, a crew. Hmm, with his little patch on. I guess he's steering it or controlling it. It's a zombie mob. That's the uh, mortar. Nice looking mortar, isn't it? Yeah. It's a, a vampire skull, is it? The walking dead shall live again. That's the animated hulks. It's got spikes right through them. And they've got a cannon attached. Surgically attached. With their left hand. Wow. And that's the deck gunners, is it? I think. Alright. And we only have wooden walls. Alright, can we see them moving up? Zombie deck gunners. Uh, we're going to have a hard time charging the artillery with those animated hulks there. Zombie deck hands, more zombie deck hands, zombie deck gunners. Well, let's at least try to charge them. Ooh, we're taking a lot of fire from these uh, hand gunners. We are uh, zombie gunnery mob. They have pistols. I don't think they have as good range. Could lose our general very quickly. Oh, wow. 
He knocked our gate down pretty quick, didn't they? Whatever was firing at it. Right, seems to be a quite a bit of lag right there. And there goes our wall as well. Wow. They can bring down a wall pretty quick, can't they? That unit took a big beating. We can actually get them down. You are taking a lot of fire because you're right behind that breach. We'll get you down as well. General's down to 11 men already. He did some damage to that unit. Uh, and get him out there. He gets killed. Uh, zombie gunnery mob. They're probably already firing as well. If we can, kill off this crew. And even focus on it. Probably lose him if he even gets shot one more time. They have black powder, so do they. They're down to two. And destroy them, then they won't be able to take our next settlement so easily. Right, that's the necroflex. Ooh, look at that. Look like a blood stain. The actual troops. Where's that other unit? That one. One. Get over there. We are trying to kill them off. Looks like they are far firing. There's 200 of them. Unit. Right. We are losing units already. seem to be having trouble to move and actually target that unit keep stopping now down to five men taking fire again the animated hulks haven't gone in they're also firing Come on, try to kill them off. Down to five men. Down to three. Hmm. Well, we caught up to that unit. Our general's pretty much dead. Might as well have a close up while we're here. Zombie deck hands. What they dual wielding swords. That's our very weak swordsman. So we're now at war with the vampire coasts. Up, ah, there goes Alfred. Alfred is down. Alright. And we've broken. They probably do cause fear. Yep, that's a pretty good uh, animation for those. Fair defeat. Well, we just captured that, didn't we? 15 minutes ago? And now we've lost it. Alrighty. I mean, we will get it back. Yeah, we're not going to fight at Musalon. They seem to be rather uh, passive there. And just staying in Musalon. So we'll just pull back. Right. And actually... They have more men coming, so I'm going to send that spy over here. And in fact, it is... 
Vampire Count's Settlement, Vivea. And look at their fleet. But they seem to be blockaded by these independent ships. Kind of look like spaceships, actually. And keep them on over there. Get back in there. Right. Assessment occupied. We lost Alfred. Vampire Coast. Vampire Counts are at War Ostermark. That's good. That's the Nash is at War with them. Right. Bitten land. Let's go and talk to them. And oh, a lot of vampires around there. Couldn't quite reach them. Ah, Kislev. Right then, just give me some money. They accepted it. I guess we'll just have to scout around on our own. Okay. This entire force. Ah, they can't reach it. Alright. That entire force. Go back and try to retake it. Plus these troops. Right. Sending you into there. Send you down there. Right. Room for two more. In there, moving you back there temporarily. Cavalry unit over there. We send two of you over there. Right, send all of you over there. Right, so we've got a decent force up there. They had that other little unit there. They might not be able to get past these. Who are the vampires at war with? Vampire Counts. Vampire Coast. They're only at war with me. It's not going to stay that way for long. Alright, Marienburg. Due to boost our economy. Impress. Rion. You could come under attack also. I'm going to put that in. We may not have enough time to get it built. We'll see. Uh, yep, I'll build Aquitaine because it's no longer in our control. Alright, well, we're going to hold on to that money for the next episode. Oh, seriously? Didn't we wipe it out? I could have sworn we wiped that out. Last. Alright, so it don't look like we did much damage at all. Alright, because they're going to be hard to deal with. Actually, anyone that has black power to be hard for us to deal with. Um, yep, so until next time, here on YouTube, thank you all for watching. Come back and watch some more. Right after you've liked, commented, and subscribed. Uh, that's okay, you don't have to do that. <laughs>